What's up everyone, welcome to the channel. USC gets blown out by Notre Dame 48 to 20. I think USC fans are starting to come to the same realization that Oklahoma fans did. I'm not gonna lie, it's been pretty entertaining looking at the USC message boards. It looks a lot like what Oklahoma fans were saying for years under Lincoln Riley. His teams are soft, they look unprepared, they look poorly coached, they're not good up front on the line of scrimmage, and whenever they play a decent team, they get exposed. I have a serious question. Is it just me or does USC look worse than they did last season? It looks like they regressed. And what's odd is that they have more talent across the board. It's almost impressive how inept Lincoln Riley is at developing talent and putting together a good team. This might honestly be one of Lincoln Riley's worst teams. Oklahoma fans have been saying it since he left, that this is who he is, because this is what he did at Oklahoma. Go back and look at the 2021 season. That was one of Oklahoma's most talented teams under Lincoln Riley, and they literally struggled every week, even against the worst teams on their schedule. And it looks eerily similar to what USC is doing now. One thing about Lincoln Riley coached teams is that he can never field a complete team. And I'm not just talking about them always having a bad defense, because even when the defense does play well and have a good game, that's when the offense starts to self-destruct. And when you look at the foundation, foundation and the culture he's built at USC, it looks really shaky. The entire program is built around one player, and it's always the star quarterback. When you look at the best programs in the country, that's not how they're built. Look at how programs like Alabama, Georgia, and Ohio State are built. Those programs build their teams from the inside out, starting up front on the line of scrimmage. And that's why Lincoln Riley never has or never will win a playoff game or a national championship. Because he's not a great coach and he doesn't know how to build a program and build a culture. And they're not even good enough to win the Pac-12 this year. I think they're going to get destroyed by Oregon and Washington. And they'll probably lose another one of those games on their schedule. I think USC going 8-4 and four this season is a real possibility. And at this point, it wouldn't surprise me if Lincoln Riley bolts to the NFL. Let me know what you think. What do you think USC's record is going to be? And do you think Lincoln Riley goes to the NFL? Let me know in the comments. I'm going to wrap this video up here. Be sure to leave a like in the video and subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'm out.